video of the house we're staying at and Dupolog or Dipolog, how you would like to pronounce it. It's up on a hill. Take a walk around. It's got uh, basically uh, three bedrooms, actually four, but they use it as a storage. One bedroom is as a storage, so we can only access three. This is the master bedroom right here with a split unit. Very cold. This is the bathroom window for the guests. This is the guest bedroom here. Nice reserved tank. Little uh, outdoor bathroom, uh, Filipino style. Nice little uh, cabana and dirty kitchen. And you got a nice little upstairs deck in view. I'll go ahead and take us up there. Traditional Filipino housing next door. Very common. Uh, this is a nice little party area deck. I find it to be a little bit hot in the middle of the day, but the uh, majority of the time, if there's a nice breeze, it's not bad to be up here, especially in the evenings or early mornings. Can't beat the view. And you got another really nice corner house over there. I think that one gets Airbnb because I haven't seen it yet in Airbnb. Like I said, you can't beat the view from up here. Here's the backyard view. We do a lot of washing here, as you can see, and they put up a line for us. So the host is very, very gracious. And um, her brother, which is the caretaker, a uh, really nice guy, takes care of you. And the reserve tank here, if the power goes out, you just switch this over and you still got water. The internet service is decent for the Philippines. You can expect it to go out at least once a day, but it'll come back on. Yeah, my son here, trying to get up the stairs, and uh, mom, mom is, look at, look at angry mom right there. Turn around, mom. Angry, angry, angry face. Yeah, that's because my son is trying to climb the stairs, and it's a no-no. No, no, no. No, no, no. no. And I'll continue the tour inside. This is the side door. It goes in to the kitchen. I'll uh, give you full views. Nice, tall ceilings. Typical um, cooking arrangement for the Philippines. Nice dual burner. Um, the gas canister, canister could be in a better place, but you know, that's the way things are here. A uh, nice dining area. Like I said, it's not air conditioned in any of the rooms except for the bedrooms. And that's pretty much how it is here in the Philippines. Um, they don't air condition the living space. So. Nice uh, little center island. Cool living room, nice TV, two fans come with the unit um, all the screen doors are very interesting because they're installed on the inside um, 
this is the little little patio area right off the living room and uh, complete with a couple of chairs we pull them over they're usually side by side you know one on each side of the table there but it tends to get wet when it rains because it pretty much rains almost every afternoon here Back in the backyard not quite as good as the one from the upper deck but still nice here's uh, the family and uh, well, it's got a nice koi pond complete with some pretty large koi all right so i'm gonna go back out and then i'll walk through the yard and you can get a nice view of the complete house Oh, I'll show you the room. So let's go upstairs. Go upstairs here. And yeah, that room right there is the storage. This is this is uh, one of the bedrooms. Very simple. You know, a couple windows, no screens on these windows. A uh, couple bunk beds. Here we got uh, the uh, bath area and shower. No heater on this one. Um, toilet is a little close to the shower door. I'm not sure. Why? But it's uh, not very nice to, if you're a big guy. Um, here it is. Ooh, yeah, this room is nice and cool. One thing, uh, nice. This is the master bedroom. Master bath. Huge bathroom. Uh, the toilet, toilet location is a lot better in this one. Um, uh, here's the master shower complete with hot water so if you want to take it's not real hot but it gets the job done and it's a lot better than just the regular so nice little there I am mm -hmm. see I'm a big guy so I know what it's like when you don't fit on the toilet All right, and here, I'll go into the second room here. We'll go out through here. Here is the second bedroom. Quick view, someone's sleeping in there. Just quick view of the second bedroom. Um, that's Chai Chai, my wife's sister, sleeping. Let's go out front door. Outside and continue. It's they got nice lighting around here too. Uh, locked front gate. Um, here's what the front door area looks like. Side of the house. Really nicely in landscape too. And uh, it's got a mango tree. Actually has some mangoes on it this time of year. This tree here, it also has edible fruit. Um, and the leaves, we, we take the leaves and put them in soups and stuff. Um, I wanna say it's called the Moringa. Palm tree. Uh-huh. Yep. So we can get a good view of the entire house. Uh-huh. See?
and we will end the tour. Say hi, honey. Hi. We'll end the tour on that. <laughs>